Does cancer get worse if it's exposed to air? I don't know if you guys have heard this. First of all, let me know in the comments if this is something that you have heard. I first heard this um, years and years ago. I had a patient and he was concerned about getting a biopsy of something that we were suspicious might be cancer. He was concerned because he felt that if it was exposed to air, uh, this mass, that it would make uh, the cancer worse if in fact it was cancer. I'd never heard that before, this idea that, um, you know, cancer will get worse if it's exposed to air. I'm, I'm going to tell you right off, guys, that is not true. Cancer is not going to get worse because it's exposed to air. If a cancer gets worse, it's because of other factors, other things, other reasons. So, so please don't uh, withhold treatment or care or biopsies or things like that because you're worried that exposure to air for some reason will make a cancer worse. I'm not exactly sure where this idea or thought has come from. Please let me know in the comments if you know. But I knew, do know that a lot of people are concerned about this. And so that's why we're talking about it. Um, the other question I wanted to answer, and you probably can tell by the title of the video, um, can, does cancer surgery or a cancer biopsy cause cancer to spread okay this is a uh, i think maybe in some ways maybe similar to the if a tumor or cancer is exposed to air will it get worse type of question um so so this is the thing um theoretically there is a chance a, a small chance that um you know, cancer could be spread by a surgical procedure but that chance is extremely extremely low you have to remember that surgeons take meticulous care when they are operating surgeons and the surgical staff, anesthesiologists, nurses, uh, everybody, they take meticulous care when doing surgeries. Um, and, 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 and so, so, but I can't say the risk is, is doesn't exist. It, the risk is there, but it's extremely, extremely low. And remember when we're talking about a biopsy, a biopsy of a mass of a thing is to figure out what well, one of the reasons we do it is to, to figure out what it is. Uh, we take a piece of it, look at it under the microscope. That's what pathologists do. And they tell us what type of cancer it is, the type of stage so that treatment can be determined. Uh, it also helps us know even if it is cancer, right? Not every mass is cancer. Okay. Uh, the other thing is that cancer surgeries um, often are to remove cancer from the body, which is generally what we want, right? Um, but back to the question, will a, a biopsy of a, a, a suspected cancer, will a cancer surgery, will that cause cancer to spread? Um, that risk is extremely, extremely low, and that is um, because of the meticulous care that our surgeons take. Guys, what's really important here, the bottom line is, I do not want you to delay your medical care, put off your medical care, uh, refuse medical care uh, for cancer, really for anything that you need treatment for, but we're talking about cancer, for cancer because of any myths like these. These are myths. And believing them could potentially lead to delays in care, um, not receiving care. Um, and that very likely and may um, uh, negatively impact your health. You can see that it, it, just, it just means a lot to me to talk about this because it makes me really sad. These are, these are myths through and through. And, and yes, there's a very small risk that uh, cancer can be spread during surgery, but that risk is super, super, super small. Um, so please, um, if you have questions or concerns about what your doctor is recommending, please talk to them about it. If you have held these beliefs, your doctor is recommending uh, surgery, whatever, please tell them what your concerns are so we can help you through this. Guys, let me know if you've heard these myths before. Let me know in the comments. Uh, share this video with other people that you think might benefit from it. Um, you know, for the patient that declined um, a biopsy, surgery, et cetera, uh, for the mass. Um, and for anyone else who believes this, you know, this is, this is why I'm doing this video. Guys, I'm Dr. Jet. It's good to see you. Um, for those of you on Facebook, please like and follow my page on YouTube. Uh, please subscribe to my channel. Click the little bell for updates. Um, check out my daily health newsletter. Go to my website, drjencaudle.com for my free health newsletter. Guys, I'm Dr. Jen. I love y'all.